All right, gather around, kitties, because this one goes out to all my homeowners. Have you ever walked down into your basement one morning and found out that it's trying to turn itself into an indoor pool? Well, we did. Turns out, overnight, our sump pump failed because of the immense amount of rain Ohio has gotten. Now, my immediate thought was, oh crap, this is going to cost thousands of dollars. But thank goodness that past Lauren had the wherewithal to get a sump pump failure rider on our insurance. Like, when I say we just renovated this basement a couple years ago, I... <laughs> I had no words. I may have cried actual tears of joy when our insurance adjuster called to tell us that we had coverage. Don't get me wrong, this still is going to cost us a little bit of money, but far less than what it would have cost if we didn't have coverage. The carpet pad and the flooring has to be replaced, but all of the walls and the baseboards survived, along with most of our furniture. I also learned way more about sump pumps than I ever wanted to know. Like, did you know that you can get a Wi-Fi capable battery backup sump pump? That way, if your first sump pump fails, you have a secondary one that's not tied to the electricity for the low, low price of $650. Moral of the story, make sure you get